What is going on YouTube? I'm Valentino with Next Gen Speed, and today I got a new part in the mail for my 2017 Camaro SS right over there, which is a new diffuser for the back. So I'm about to open it up, get it checked out, and get it put on the car. Let's see how it looks. You can see it's right over here, made by Icon Motorsports, but you can pick this up at nextgenspeed.com. Hook you up. Oh yeah, got some nice wrapping, keep it nice and protected. And there she is, all nice and painted black, same color as before. And this is similar to the regular diffuser that comes on the car, but has these cuts in it and these fins, which makes it look a lot better. Instead of just a plain flat plastic piece, pop out a lot more, makes the car look a lot better. It's about to look killer, especially with these dark and clear reflectors for the back. I'm about to put these on real quick with it. Get these at nextgenspeed.com for about 35 to 45 bucks, depending if it's on sale or not. So check that out if you guys want. These are made to match the clear and black tail lights. As you can see, it's not like a full black, it's kind of a clear and black. Which honestly is about to look awesome. I'll show you guys. These are a simple install, especially when these are out of the car. Because when the diffuser is still on, it's a bitch to get to because you have to kind of go in there and kind of feel where the bolt is and try to line up with the screwdriver. And it's just a pain in the ass, but this makes it a lot easier that I have this off. As you can see, just one, just one screw in the back of this. You put the screw in and you're all set. All right. All right, so now that I got the collectors in there, all set and ready to go, let's get it put on the car. Look at that shit. No diffuser or valance, <laughs> looking all weird and shit. The big ass bath tube fucking muffler. About to take that out soon actually guys. Let me know which exhaust you guys would like to see on the channel and which you guys think looks or sounds best because I'm about to get something, so stay tuned for that. If you want to find out how to take this rear valance off and put it back on, watch my previous video on how to take it off because it's pretty much the same procedure, just backwards. So check that out if you guys haven't yet. Ranch in, let's get this thing going. She is officially on. Looking badass, looking killer. Just like I always wanted it to look. Starting to come along together nice. Get some black tail lights, some other stuff. Just right over there, give you a little peek. But yeah. And it was a bitch installing. Took about like 45 minutes to get it back on. And you will need two people to do it because it is kind of hard. Subscribe and like the video to stay tuned to see what's coming next for this car. Got a lot of stuff planned, so stay tuned. And besides that, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys want to get one of these for about 180, check out nextgenspeed.com. Get you hooked up right. Get your Camaro looking nice. But please like and subscribe for more. I will see you guys next time.